Three, two, one. Now it's time for... What's up, my friends? Kevin here, the Tattoo Toy Owner. Today, I'm going to be doing an unboxing of a figure I picked up recently. It's going to be a customized figure, so he doesn't really fit into one toy genre or one company brand. I think he's part Diamond Select, part NECA, and maybe something else. But this is going to be Arnold Schwarzenegger as the Governator. Thank you. Thank you. That's right. <laughs> he's not going to be commando he's not going to be a terminator he's going to kind of be his own he's going to be actual figure of the actor when he was the governor so of california so this guy i found on ebay that does these kind of i guess there's mostly going to be uh what do they call them when they just swap parts uh basically part swapping but he does customizing some molding some painting and stuff but this one i thought looked really cool so i put in a bid best offer and got it at a real reasonable price and i'm very excited to have him and add him to my collection i think he's really cool looking so let's go ahead and uh, get these accessories opened and see what the governator comes with comes with a really nice uh a lot of detail uh based so that way I can pose him in my collection. I'm gonna do like starting, I'm gonna do a NECA collection. I have some NECA figures here and there, but I wanna start doing a section just for them. So this'll be nice to put him in. It's got nice paint to it, it's got some nice sculpt to it. And then he comes with this awesome rifle. A lot of detail to it. You got some paint in there, I can see some gold, some gray. A lot of detail to the little sliding mechanisms and handles and switches really cool but this is what everybody wants to see at least this is what i want to see so without further ado let's carve this bad boy open and take a look at the governator i should have got my buddy uh harry sam npr vlogs who does a good arnold impersonation man this thing is taped very well so this person that does these customizing, not only do they do a really good job, they do a really good job shipping. So you can tell that it's not their first rodeo when it comes to shipping. Okay, I think I got through it. That was some thick tape. And it's still giving me a hard time. There we go. It does not mess around. All right. So let's go ahead and take a look at the governor here. You go and stand for me, buddy. So these, he kind of is pre-posed. It's not one of the bodies that are super articulated, which is okay for me, but I think he did a really good job. So he's just kit bashing, I think, uh, most of this. I love the face, it does look like it kind of a middle-aged maybe he should have been a little older for being the governor but i mean it articulates really well you get very little up and down on the body but he has that high collar the white shirt i think i want to get a little u.s flag here for him kind of make kind of get a little u.s flag here i probably got got a spam call so it kind of cut me off so upper arm is on a ball so you get quite a bit of articulation there you got a single elbow that's actually hinged and swivels, so you get a lot of articulation there. The hand is pegged in. It's kind of odd the way it's, but it's made to be put on the hip, so you can tell that's just the way it was made. He's married, he's got his ring. It's got nice detail and sculpt to this body. It kind of looks to me like, what is that, Abraham or one of the Walking Dead figures? I don't know if that's this body. Other arm, same thing, you got arm is on a ball. You got a single elbow, but it is hinged and pegs, so it has a lot of good play. Hand has a lot of good play as well. Uh, the waist is kind of weird. You have, you can feel that there is 
a waist in there that swivels, but because of the shirt, you can't get any, hardly any move to it, unfortunately. The groin here piece where the legs connect, they're kind of just pegged in, so they're real pre-posed to only move a certain way, which is unfortunate. <laughs> I would rather them have more articulation. The knees, however, they do have that ratchet hinge in there. So that's all you get backwards. And same same thing on the other one. That's all you get backwards. And then you can take them up till they match up to the seam, which is okay. That's fine with me. The feet, they got a little bit of play to them. They're pegged in, so they can just kind of, they got a little bit up and down, a little side to side, very little, I mean. But all in all, I love the way he is poses. Let's go ahead and put him on a stand. So he's very cool, the governator. I'll be back. I dropped $20 on him, I believe, with shipping and all. I think he was like 18 or less, but with shipping, he was, I believe, about close to 20 ish. So he's going to be in my necro section when I start putting it together. That's how he looks. I think he looks really good. Everybody, welcome to the Gumminator. <laughs> good job. I enjoy them a lot. I hope you enjoyed it. I think that's about all I have to show. Maybe I can put them up with some uh, fellas so you can see a difference in the sizes. We'll go with uh, Marvel Legends Kingpin from the retro card. Here's another Marvel Legends figure. We'll go with the Stan Lee exclusive. He's been sitting so long. Work with me here. Work with me here, bud. What else do I got? Okay, we'll go to my Mattel Elite. Mr. T, he's sitting around, so I said, you know what, I'll just bust him out. It's one of my favorites right now, so. Of course, he's up almost an inch with his stand, but he looks really good. And that's gonna be my haul, my friends. That's gonna be the unboxing and the review of the Governator Arnold Schwarzenegger. Thank you so much. This is the Tattoo Toy Hunter reminding you never give up that hunt. Pew, 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 pew. Peace, y'all. Y'all take care.